I'm going to do an exercise for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you're new to this version, there's a link in the video description below so you can learn the fundamentals. One of the things about American Mahjong is that every hand has a value. Although some groups do not score, they just play for fun. So if you are new to scoring, I hope this video helps because we're going to practice scoring a hand. If you're new to Mahjong or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. Here's a hand that I played at Mahjong time. This is the second hand down under the year category. I was ready to win and the player to my left discarded the winning tile. Score this. Since this hand can use jokers here and here, but there are no jokers, the value of this hand is doubled. So instead of a 25 point hand, it is now a 50 point hand. The player to the left pays double since they discarded the winning tile. So they will owe 100 points. The other two players will owe 50 points. So this hand earned 200 points. The National Mahjong League reserves space on the back of the card for scoring. So if you forget how to score, just read the back of the card. There's a section in the lower left corner of the first panel of the card. There's also a place in there that describes the bonus, and that would be when you play a hand that is allowed to have jokers, but you have no jokers. That's called a jokerless hand, and it's double value. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.